Oh man, yeah. cash money, will there ever you think and it's just your opinion. Do you think there'll ever be a reunion like they be they 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 talk about? As long as they're alive, yeah, man. It's a chance. Yeah, bro. Yeah, man. People people learn and we grew. You know what I'm saying? Like and they they growing. Wow. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. It'd be, it be different reasons or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Okay, because I heard, I remember interviewing someone before, I think it was Deli Ranks, and he was saying the reason why he became a producer, learned how to produce his own music, because he's also an artist, is because, you know, other producers be messing up their stuff or holding back their music, or, and it don't come out. Right. So that's why I was just trying to figure out. Yeah, everybody not go-getters, man. Y'all not about to do this interview and hold this interview. Mm -hmm. Y'all gonna let this out. Yeah, exactly. You feel me? So, exactly. you know what I'm saying? Everybody don't have that same feeling. Mm -hmm. You feel me? That's just how it be. I had another question. I see you have a tooth, gold tooth, right? Yeah. I know that's like a Louisiana thing, right? Or is it a New Orleans thing? It's just a little thing thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's the meaning behind it? I just want, when you look at me, I want you to, you know what I'm saying, see something special sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't, ain't that I meant to do it or whatever. You know what I'm okay. saying? It's just, you know, it feel good. Okay. You feel me? Wow. Um... You know, like I said, I I I definitely know that New Orleans is a different beast, man. When you you hear about twerking, they they claim that too. They claim everything. You know what I'm saying? Down there, why do you think the music is so like y'all got jazz, y'all got all kind of music, man? Like, why do you think that 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 soul that 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 music is so embedded? You know what I'm saying? We got some hardcore music levels, man. Like you know what I'm saying. Our city built up. Like you gotta understand when people die. A lot of people die in our city. We we celebrate that. Shit. I know. You know what I'm saying like we throw big big old second line block parties. You know what I'm saying? It goes on for years. You know what I'm saying? We don't forget about you. Keep the culture alive. Like you know what I'm saying? So. Wow. That's just something that we all grew up into. Like, it's just been going on. It's been going on, man. Yeah. Cash money, whatever you think, and it's just your opinion. Do you think there'll ever be a reunion like they be they, they, they talk about? As long as they're alive, yeah, man. It's a chance. Yeah, bro. Yeah, man. People people learn, and we grew. You know what I'm saying? Like, and they, they growing. Wow. I yeah. know what? you work. Go ahead. What's the most memorable moment you've had in your career so far that you can mention? That stands out to you. Wow. Getting that big check. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna tell you the truth, me. That shit almost fucked me up seeing all that money. <laughs> shit, boy. I was, who? When that thing come when, in, when that you... life changing moment hit. Yeah, you can't forget about that. And I'm able to do more for my kids and my mama and myself. You know what I'm saying? And be able to see different parts of the world and shit like you know, that's 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 what it's about. That is that your ultimate goal is to make enough money that you know you can have everybody set is that true no, happiness to that you ain't, that ain't my goal because like i ain't come from i ain't come from money you know what i'm okay. saying so i never really thought about it like that you know what i'm saying like i enjoy just seeing people i love and you know what i'm saying the people i love seeing them happy okay you feel me? wow um when it come down to it you know i know you work with var like how hard is it to work with him in the studio very you know, Very I just want to like well, what what's the what's the complicated thing that you know besets you when you're dealing with a vault? Because one moment he'll love you, and the next moment he'll love you. You get it? Okay, okay. Because he loves differently. <laughs> like you know, if you don't get it, he, you 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 you'll been a got it toy with him. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like yeah, he's just f crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no. Is he the most difficult person you ever worked with? Yes. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Definitely. Man, and that's crazy because at the end of the day, that's the one that that's the one you rock out with the most. Yeah, yeah. my dog, bro. Like man, Vol, like we we click click. How did y'all meet, bro? Like because my thing with like he he knew what he wanted to do. How did you guys meet? Oh man. Um I don't even remember, bro. It's been that long? Because we done been around each other for so much, so long, it just feel like we've been knowing each other for forever, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's hard. That's hard. But, you know, like, through the music, like, we, we met through the music, whatever. And I don't, I don't, like, when I was DJing, he posted been and came on stage and tried to get me to play one of his songs, and I wasn't having that. And he used to taking DJ's equipment to lose while they DJing in the really? middle. Really? Oh, yeah. He crazy, bro. He aggravated about yeah, it. Yeah, he aggravated. You ain't playing that music, he gonna pull all your all off, all pull the speakers out, everything, push everything down. 
it's funny you talk about that because that's what <laughs> <laughs> they talk about on the show. Gilp talked about Soldier Slim and him being in New York, and uh, Funkmaster Flex wouldn't play the wouldn't play his music after he heard him play in Juvie. You know, what, uh, Juvie's song. He's yeah. like thinking that he was gonna get his played. And he wouldn't play it, and it upset him. Yeah. So I know them New Orleans oh, boys yeah, get a little upset primer. about that music. It's deep, boys. It's deep. Because they be done worked on it. They passionate about it, man. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101.